up as the king of K-pop here with another K-pop review. Uh, this is on Four Minutes, um, newest uh, single. Uh, what's 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 your name? What's your name? Um, this song. This is the. I think this. If you look at the timing, I think this may mark a year. It's been a year since uh, Four Minute, uh, their last promotion that they did last year. Um, this is a collaboration they've done with Bray Brothers. And I'm trying to think. Uh, I think this is the first time they've worked with Brave Brothers. If not, maybe the second, because I think their last song, um, Brave Brothers wrote as well, the same time when he did uh, Sis Stars uh, Alone. So, correct me if I'm wrong or not, I think it's maybe the first or second time. But looking back in days past, Four Minute hasn't worked with Brave Brothers, if memory serves me right. Um, so, this would be like the first, like I said, or second time. Uh, what's your name? Long awaited debut of Four Minute. Um, I mean, return of Four Minute. Glad they're back. Uh, the song itself, it's uh, well, before you get into the song, I'll get into the video. Uh, I really like the video. I think the video is, is a, a nice kickback to uh, you know, their old school roots. Uh, it reminds me a little of a mixture of uh, music and FX's uh, new ABL. Um, I know if you guys probably seen a lot of my K pop reviews, I really make a lot of comparisons to new ABL, the video, but um. It reminds me of a mixture of those two, of music and like the color, you know, neon colors and, you know, glow in the dark kind of like stuff, like, like music, but then it has that fun, upbeat energy that New ABO has of, of FX. Um, so it really reminds me of that, really brought back their, uh, you know, their old school kind of like roots, um, not very as sensual as a lot of their, as their last promotion or the last promotions they've been doing over the last couple of years. So they really kind of toned it down a little bit um, in terms of like you know them being sensual or sort of a sexy side or whatever uh, which I think a lot of fans could a lot of fans that complain about four minute and being too overly exposed uh, may be happy this time around um, but anyway um, I think the video is just fun I kind of got confused I couldn't understand the one part was like okay first they're fun they're you know they're doing you know they're dressing up they're doing lots of fun stuff but then all of a sudden, like, zombies just, like, come out of nowhere, and then they turn into zombies, and it's like a Michael Jackson thriller. And I'm like, what? what's the point of the zombie thing? I thought the zombie thing was kind of useless. Anyway, on the song itself. Um, the song is not bad. It's okay. Uh, one thing I, I do like about the song is the, uh, it has, like, this uh, arcade uh, game kind of, like, sound to it. Uh, it's, it's really repetitive and really catchy. Um, of course, the the chorus is is catchy as well, a, a little a little catchy. Um, the song is not bad, but it's not a great song either. Um, you know, most of the time when Brave Brothers, I've noticed it from years of his career, that if it's an artist that Brave Brothers is just getting used to, if it's a first collaboration, sometimes that first to second single that he makes for that artist isn't that great. Um, yes, you have to build up a relationship with them, and then the songs get kind of better and better because he's used and suited to you know the members and their style and their talent and what they're good and what they aren't good at. That's why you have groups like you know Sis Star and uh, Sundam B and uh, Teen Top. Every time you make songs with them, they're like a hit because he's used to them because he's did that. He's worked with them for years, so he knows the members and know what they what they like or not. Uh, four minute here. This is the first collaboration they've done with the Brave Brothers. If not, like I said again earlier in this video, probably their second because I think he did their last one too last year. So, um, in comparison, I thought last year's song was better than this year. This year's song is not it's not bad, but like I said, if this is their first or second collab with Brave Brothers, this is what normally happens when you work with Brave Brothers. If it's your first or second collab, the songs aren't that really that great um, at first. Um, so the song is not bad. Um, probably have to listen to it a little bit more uh, to to really like get behind it for it to really like stick stick to you. Um, but at the same token, while you're listening to it, it's not a bad listen. It's a decent song. Uh, you, like I said, you you may forget about it after you're done hearing it. You may forget that you heard the song, uh, but you'll probably come back to it again just because it's four minute and they are a popular girl group and. You know, if you're a fan, obviously can't help but support them. Uh, Hyuna, they all look great. Hyuna still looks sexy. Um, 
They all looked really cute and adorable. So uh, I thought it was a fun video, and the song is all right. Let me know what you guys think of four minutes. Come back and return the video and the song of What's Your Name in the box below. This is the King of K-Pop. Subscribe. Peace.